This little fish went to explore the deep sea. As it descends, the pressure increases, it gets colder and much darker. In the darkness of the deep sea, the spots of light you find are generated by the organisms that live there. For this bioluminescence, no external light source is needed. Fluorescence is another type of luminescence that occurs in marine animals. Here, the emission of light is triggered by the absorbance of an external light. This is the vampire squid. It lives below 600 meters in the water column and uses bioluminescence to survive in this extreme environment. The light is generated within the organism through biochemical reactions. These take place inside specialized organs called photophores. Here we have the molecule luciferin. In the presence of oxygen, luciferase, an enzyme, catalyzes a reaction of luciferin which creates the luminous glow. The vampire squid feeds off detritus that sinks to the deep sea. This marine snow often contains bioluminescent organisms. The vampire squid's large and sensitive eyes help it spot this bioluminescence of the little food that reaches the deep. It uses retractable filaments to capture it. When in danger, the vampire squid releases a luminous fluid from its arm tips. While this grenadier is distracted by the luminescent cloud, the squid escapes into the darkness. In addition, the fluid sticks to the grenadier, making it easier for larger predators to find it. Of course, the vampire squid is not the only one who uses bioluminescence to gain an advantage. Attracted by the glow of what may be food, it finds itself at the mouth of yet another predator. It raises its glowing arm tips over the head and mantle, exposing its fleshy spines and forming a sacrificial lure of its own. This is a female black sea devil, a species of anglerfish. The anglerfish hosts symbiotic luminous bacteria in its esker or lure. By controlling the conditions in the esca, it controls the intensity and duration of the glow emitted by the bacteria. While the bacteria gain a safe environment to live in, the anglerfish gains an effective method to attract prey and potential mates. Sexual dimorphism is common in anglerfish. The small parasitic male attaches itself to a female and remains attached for the rest of their lives. Bioluminescence evolved independently over 40 times, illustrating its importance in animal survival and success in the deep sea. Please pause on the question to give yourselves time to answer. What is the name of the enzyme involved in creating a glow? The enzyme is called luciferase. Name one defense strategy of the vampire squid. It ejects luminous fluid from its arm tips and turns itself inside out and creates a sacrificial lure. What are functions of the esker of an anglerfish? The esker is thought to attract potential food and mates. <laughs> 